Enjoy an evening of great entertainment and fabulous food as mangoes will make your dining experience a memorable one. Hello, I'm Carolina and welcome to Miami and the beaches on the Welcome Channel. Come and enjoy an exquisite fusion of new world flavors prepared by award-winning executive chef Norman Van Aken at Tuyo. Miami has everything that a sports fanatic would love under the sun. We'll take a look. The Welcome Channel takes a look at some must-visit locales in the emerging world-class neighborhood. Coming up. Hi, I'm April Donaldson. Everyday visitors from all over the world come right here to Miami and its beautiful beaches. And what so many people don't know is this area is home to so many health and fitness activities. So what we're gonna do today on Active Miami is give you an inside look into some of Miami and the beach's very best. So let's go to Miami, coming up. South Point Park is so special because it's a, a combination of many pieces and parts. First of all, it, it has a long history of being in South Beach. This originally used to be a, a, a site for, a Navy, for the Navy, Coast Guard. It was the, the property was given to us through the Coast Guard, through the United States government, and we converted it into a park. It used to also be a racetrack, a dog track was here. So it has a long history. The second thing that makes it so special is that there's there's parts and pieces for everyone. First of all, we're standing in probably one of the highest points in Miami Beach right now as we speak. The beautiful deck overlooking the, the water and overlooking the park. So we have the ability to do all the fun things and we're beautifully located right next to the ocean and the beach. So South Beach, Miami Beach, South Point Park, it's just all, all together it belongs here. In 1963, the, um, the Bass family, John and Joanna Bass, gave their entire collection of Renaissance, Baroque, and Antiquities collection to the city of Miami Beach. So the city founded the museum. They found a, a housing for it, which was an old library um, designed by Pankos, which you can see right behind me. Visitors should make sure that they stop by the Bass Museum before they leave Miami Beach. We have, and starting from our latest project, in May we opened the only Egyptian gallery in Florida. So if you come from a place that doesn't have an Egyptian gallery, or any Egyptian art, this is the ideal opportunity for you to see mummies and sarcophagus and, and um, Egyptian objects. I'd like to personally invite all the visitors of Miami and the beaches to come by the Bass Museum, enjoy a day of culture, music, friends, and also come to the park, bring a picnic. We have this beautiful new park in Collins Park, so both things make for a full day of enjoyment, culture, and family and friends. Improvements are constantly being made to make our 7.1 square mile city shine. Here's more on the renovation to this beautiful space, Collins Park. The park, named after Miami Beach developer John Collins, was created in the 1920s as a public garden. The multi-million dollar project was shaped by resident feedback through community meetings. The city residents were very adamant that what they wanted was a passive park. They didn't want ball fields, they didn't want soccer fields, they, uh, we, they wanted a passive formal park. Collins Park is surrounded by some of our leading cultural anchors, including the Bass Museum of Art, which was also renovated by the city's Office of Capital Improvement Projects in 2004. Next door is the Miami City Ballet. And you have the new Regional Public Library. Clusters of palm trees surround the open lawn. Ancient baobab trees tower over the park, while Malayan green palms line the promenade. The eastern portion of the park includes green space, and the city was able to maintain another scarce resource, nearly 300 parking spots. So I think the city should be very proud of what they did over there to create a parking lot that is not only safe for the pedestrians, but also turtle safe. Overall, the project has brought harmony between the park and its architectural elements. The 1930s keystone facade at the Bass Museum, the restored rotunda with its 1960s sandcast panels, and the 21st century design of Tempest, the park's public art installation. With so much going on in the cultural campus of our city, the new Collins Park also offers the perfect spot for quiet reflection. 
It's a convenient and affordable way to get all around South Beach, riding the South Beach local. For just 25 cents, you can travel from 20th Street down to South Point Drive along Alton Road and Washington Avenue. And for your convenience, there's stops all along the way. Traveling around South Beach is a breeze. Just make sure you have exact change. For more information from bus locations to hours of operation, check out our website at miamibeachfl.gov or call 305-604-CITY. Rent spontaneously. That's the motto of the new Hertz on Demand car sharing program. We're the first city in the state to launch a shared car service. We have a shared bike program. We have a lot of pedestrian and bike lanes that allow for people to get to where they need to go. But that one missing ingredient was from time to time you do need a car. You don't need it all the time, but you do need it from time to time. Let Hertz on Demand fill that need. Membership is free and easy. First step, sign up online at HertzOnDemand.com. Then you'll get a fob that looks like this in the mail. Wipe this key fob in front of a windshield. The doors are going to open and the keys are already inside the vehicle and stay inside at all time. And you can start the engine and start your journey. The hourly rental rate starts at just $9. The daily rental rate starts at $63. Pick out your vehicle online and then pick it up at one of the eight city garages that house the Hertz on Demand vehicles. There is no cost to the city for this program and the savings it will create in parking, mobility, and for the environment has the potential to positively impact our entire city. The green transportation revolution has begun. First in Barcelona, then Paris, and now the city of Miami Beach and its world-famous South Beach Art Deco District. DecoBike is the new zero-pollution public transit system, serving residents and visitors alike, that is also healthy, fast, and efficient. Miami Beach is a city known across the globe for its sunny weather, top-notch entertainment, beautiful people, and amazing beaches and scenery. But at the same time, it's also a city that is helping lead the way with green practices and sustainable transportation initiatives. After all, going green isn't just a trend, it's a responsibility. So what exactly is DecoBike? DecoBike is the City of Miami Beach Public Bicycle Rental and Sharing Program, an automated European-style system that allows riders to check out a DecoBike from any station in the city and return it to any station when done. Simply replace those short trips normally made by car with DecoBike, like to the market, bank, or your office to save time, money, and the environment. DecoBike puts bike sharing on the map with the most comprehensive citywide program in the United States that is helping to move an entire city of people faster, healthier, and greener than ever before. With more than 100 solar-powered deco stations, the Miami Beach system is capable of operating in excess of 1,000 custom deco bikes, serving all major points of interest throughout the city. Whether your destination is your home, office, or the newest and coolest restaurant or hotel, deco bike is there waiting for you at your doorstep 24 hours per day, 365 days a year. The best way to enjoy the world-famous Ocean Drive in Lincoln Road Mall is on a Deco Bike. Deco Bike is so easy to use, anyone can do it. A credit card or Deco Bike membership card provides access to the program. You don't have to pre-register. Simply approach any station, swipe your card, follow the instructions, and ride. Deco Bike's easy to understand, multiple language menus and website make the program friendly, even to travelers from outside the country. DecoBike also features exclusive iPhone and BlackBerry applications, plus a live interactive web-based Deco map showing the locations of all stations, available bikes, and vacant docking spaces in real time, plus nearby shops and attractions. A DecoBike Beach Pass membership has lots of privileges. Aside from unlimited access to the program, Beach Pass holders will also enjoy invites to exclusive parties, events, contests and promotions in and around Miami Beach. Beach Pass sign-up is simple and is made available online at www.decobike.com. DecoBike's primary goals are to reduce the need for automobiles and fossil fuels, to help rid the atmosphere of harmful air pollution, and to improve upon the health and fitness of the entire community. DecoBike is also the fastest and most convenient way to get around the city. No more worrying about storing and maintaining your own bike, because with DecoBike, that's all included as a part of your membership. And besides, DecoBike is your bike. 
With so many Deco Station locations to choose from, there's no more wasting time or fuel stuck in traffic unnecessarily. You won't have to waste any more of your time looking for hard-to-find parking spaces for your car or spend another dollar on cab fares. With Deco Bike, you take the shortest and most direct routes to all your destinations, virtually eliminating the need for an automobile throughout the city. Deco Bike is smart. Each Deco Bike is uniquely identifiable and is equipped with RFID tracking, which tells us who the rider is, how far he or she traveled, the length of time spent riding, and can even calculate the carbon offset for your journeys. The Deco stations communicate with the Deco Bike Operations Center, processing transactions and reporting availability around the clock. Deco Bike is fun. Visitors, locals, and all your friends and family can enjoy the best shops, restaurants, parks, and attractions throughout the city. Deco Bike gets you in places cars simply can't go. Deco Bike is the cleanest and greenest method of transportation available. Motor vehicles produce about $60 billion per year in health related damages. So, what is the solution? Deco Bike is your new green urban commuter. It requires no fossil fuels and has the efficiency equivalent of over 3,000 miles per gallon. Deco Bike is healthy. Biking to work or around town is one of the easiest ways to lose weight, boost your health and energy levels while helping minimize your risk of cancer and heart disease. You can stay fit just by commuting around town on a Deco Bike. Isn't it time to simplify your life? For information and memberships, visit www.decobike.com. For your convenience, you can also visit the Deco Store, located at 723 Washington Avenue in South Beach, where you can ask questions about the Deco Bike program, get helmets, locks, apparel, souvenirs, and other accessories for your journey, or sign up for a membership. Follow Deco Bike on Twitter, Facebook, and YouTube. Deco Bike is for experienced riders ages 18 and over. Wearing a properly fitted helmet is the only way to help reduce your risk of a head injury in the event of an accident. Always obey all traffic control devices and look carefully before entering or crossing any type of intersection, road, sidewalk, or walkway. Do you deco bike? What does $2.35 get you these days? A ride to the airport. Introducing the airport flyer. <laughs> The Express Bus shuttles you from the Miami International Airport to Miami Beach and back to the airport for a mere $2.35 each way. Also called Route 150, the airport flyer runs seven days a week. From about 6 o'clock a.m. to 11 o'clock p.m., it makes stops every 30 minutes. Find out where to catch the airport flyer by visiting miamidade.gov forward slash transit. Coming up, we'll preview the crown jewel atop Miami-Dade College's new Miami Culinary Institute, Tuya. Hi, I'm Aubrey Aquino for the Welcome Channel. Get ready, sports fans, as we take a fantastic tour of the biggest and hottest pro sports teams in the country that make their home right here in Miami. At Sun Life Stadium, the Miami Dolphins offer football fans an exciting taste of the NFL experience. From the hard-hitting plays happening on the field, to the Dolphins cheerleaders on the sidelines, fans can live it up in more ways than one come game time. Take a look. It's a new era in South Florida as the Miami Dolphins have kicked off another season with a brand new head coach. Game day for fans in Miami means lots of NFL action on the field as the team tackles opponents on their home turf. Plus, any trip to the Dolphins Stadium is sure to entertain with the traditional sights and sounds of the NFL and some Miami Spice added in. The Miami Marlins are the main attraction in their very own brand new ballpark. Marlins Park is located right in the heart of Miami and it's a state-of-the-art facility that can accommodate 37,000 fans and did I mention it's a very cool retractable roof? Check it out. The two-time World Series champion Marlins are loving their new home in Little Havana. Now dubbed the Miami Marlins, the team is looking forward to many successful seasons in their new park. But what truly sets this ballpark apart from others in Major League Baseball is its South Florida appeal. 
The roof will definitely offer a great experience uh, to our fans because they'll be able to be at 75 degree weather at all times, very comfortable. Uh, and right when you walk in, you know, you're able to see the, the aquariums uh, that you know, are representative of the Miami landscape with, with the coral reef and the uh, tropical fish. Uh, also, we've got art throughout the ballpark in the east and west plaza also. Um, the ballpark is also unique in the different culinary options it offers. We have, uh, you know, we have your traditional hot dogs and, and your beer and, and, and your hamburgers to enhance that, uh, your traditional baseball experience. But then, of course, you've got empanadas and Cuban sandwiches and your sushi. Uh, after all, we are Miami, right? Other cool sites include a bobblehead museum. This fun feature is sure to make you shake your head and smile. Then there's the home run sculpture that only goes in motion for Grand Slams. And a huge window that offers one-of-a-kind views to the city. This is very much a family-friendly atmosphere, so we encourage families to come out here and experience a world-class baseball at Marlins Park. So why not take the time out to enjoy a day at the ball game with the Miami Marlins? The Miami Heat are the reigning NBA champions, and there's nothing hotter than being courtside for a game where you can watch the team's stars, LeBron James, Dwayne Wade, and Chris Bosh, hoop it up. Here's a glimpse into the star-studded action at American Airlines Arena. Every single night, uh, we're going to make the world know, not just this league, we're going to make the world know that the Heat is back. It's special, and you, you want to be a part of, you know, a something like that. You don't see it that often um, in sports, and to have an opportunity, you know, to put myself in a position where I can be one of those guys, um, that's something that I would hang my head on just as much as you hang your head on scoring titles you got or, um, or championships you won or all-star game MVPs you won. I can hang my head on being a guy that, you know, possibly can go down and play with one organization, and, um, and I'll always be, you know, I'll always be a, a heat. It's gonna be, it's gonna be some tough times, you know. It's, we're gonna have highs and lows, ups and downs, just like, just like anybody else. But um, if it's family, you can pull together a lot faster than, than people who aren't. And um, just to put on that jersey and just to feel the warmth and the welcomeness that they that they uh, bring bring here, it's um, it's cool. It's a lot of pride. It gives me a lot of pride in what I do. And you know, given our situation, it makes it that much more important. With all the exciting pro sports events happening around Miami, you don't want to miss out on your opportunity to catch a game firsthand. For the Welcome Channel, I'm Aubrey Aquino. The Tuyo Restaurant, we're part of the uh, Miami Dade College of the Miami Culinary Institute, and we sit on the eighth floor, which is the rooftop overlooking all of downtown. The gastronomy of Tuyo is New World Cuisine, which is a term that I came up with many years ago cooking in Key West. The idea of New World Cuisine is it's a celebration of the diverse cultures that comprise the populations of South Florida. And so you will see many elements of Latin, Caribbean, African, even Asian foods that really dot our menus and help us tell the story in very full flavored ways. When the guest sits down at the table at Tuyo, they have the opportunity to look at two different menus. We have the a la carte menu, and that changes uh, seasonally, along with uh, dishes that are Norman Van Aken's signature dishes. And then also, in addition to the a la carte, we have the tasting menu, but here we call it the Voyager menu. And so what that means is that we're going to take our guests on a voyage, starting right here at home in Miami, but then we're going to voyage out to many different ports of call in the world, and every month we'll go to a different one and uh, work with local produce and local fish and things like that, but inspire to make the menu in a way that really takes people on a journey. Everybody's discovering Tuyo. Macy's is America's favorite department store. With over 800 locations nationwide, Macy's is recognized worldwide for its fashions, selection, and iconic events. Macy's offers the latest fashions and accessories from the most sought-after American designers and brands 
making it a dynamic shopping experience for millions of visitors each year. With the Macy's Visitor Savings Program, domestic and international travelers receive an exclusive 10% discount on thousands of items throughout the store for multiple days of shopping. With qualifying ID, visitors can pick up a savings pass in any one of our stores or visitor centers nationwide. Macy's Visitor Program offers exclusive discounts on designer brands. Visitors can also take advantage of personal services at our centers, including informational maps and concierge services, such as restaurant suggestions and transportation advice. They can even purchase exclusive shopping packages tailored to the city they're visiting. For store locations and more information, visit www.visitmacysusa.com. Set in the heart of downtown Miami, the Adrian Arsht Center for the Performing Arts of Miami-Dade County is Miami's crown jewel and one of the nation's premier performing arts centers. With more than 500 performances each year, the center is a world-class showcase for ballet, opera, Broadway, concerts, and free family-friendly events year-round. Welcoming half a million patrons each year, the Arsht Center is easily accessible from many points in South Florida. It's a 15-minute cab ride from South Beach, Coral Gables, and Coconut Grove. The Arsht Center Metro Mover Station is just one block from the entrance. Bus Route A from Miami Beach drops passengers just one block from the entrance. And for those driving themselves, plentiful parking is across the street and can be reserved in advance online or by phone. Inaugurated in 2006, the 570,000 square foot complex designed by world-renowned architect Cesar Pelli features three stunning performance venues that host a myriad of stars, from Tony Bennett and Billy Crystal to Jerry Seinfeld and Itzhak Perlman. The Ziff Ballet Opera House is one of the largest stages in the country and has been deemed to have the city's best live theater by the Miami New Times. The 2,400-seat La Scala-style theater features an award-winning lineup of Broadway's biggest hits each season. The Ziff Ballet Opera House is also the Miami home to the Florida Grand Opera, now celebrating 70 years of presenting critically acclaimed productions and home to the internationally renowned Miami City Ballet, which was founded 25 years ago and continues to be led by Edward Villela. Both the opera and the ballet are resident companies of the Arsht Center. Tickets start at only $25. ID runs through September 4th. A pedestrian walkway that overlooks Biscayne Boulevard joins the Ziff Ballet Opera House with the John S. and James L. Knight Concert Hall, a state-of-the-art acoustic masterpiece acclaimed by the world's best classical artists and thousands of audience members for its incredible sound quality. The Knight Concert Hall at the Arsht Center is home to one of the most important jazz concert series in the country, Jazz Roots, which regularly brings together Grammy Award-winning jazz legends and the brightest stars on the jazz scene. In the Knight Concert Hall, audiences can also enjoy a stellar classical music series, as well as the best comedians, hip-hop artists, and Latin music entertainers of our time. Adding to the thrilling action on the main stages are the Arsht Center's outdoor Thompson Plaza for the Arts and the intimate Carnival Studio Theater. The Thompson Plaza is the showcase for the Center's free monthly Family Fest and many other festivals throughout the year and is also an excellent location from which to enjoy Miami's year-round warmth pre- and post-show. The Carnival Studio Theater is the center's black box space where guests can see cutting edge theater, critically acclaimed performers from all over the world, and Miami's own talented artists all close up. This theater is home to City Theater's annual Summer Shorts program, one of the only short play festivals in the United States, and the International Hispanic Theater Festival, a showcase of the newest theatrical work from the Americas. From the moment you purchase your ticket to the final encore, the Arsht Center offers the best entertainment experience. And now your evening can include a memorable gourmet dining experience right on site. Welcome to Prelude. Guests can make reservations for elegant pre or post show dining at the sumptuous Prelude by Barton G, an elegant restaurant created by one of Miami's most popular restaurateurs. Interested in what goes on behind the scenes at one of the country's most important performing arts centers? The Adrian Arsht Center offers free tours on Mondays and Saturdays at noon in English and Spanish. Miami is in the height of a cultural renaissance, and the Arsht Center is at the center of it all, 
with a year-round lineup of spectacular world-class concerts, the best of Broadway, thrilling dance presentations, award-winning theater, and much more. During this visit to South Florida, make sure to get a taste of Miami culture and enjoy the magic of the live performing arts. The Arsht Center is an absolute must when visiting Miami. The Welcome Channel invites you to Lincoln Road. Lincoln Road is a high voltage mix of sexy and demure and is every bit as charming. Lincoln Road is most renowned for its many sidewalk cafes and restaurants. Most restaurants offer either indoor or outdoor seating, including dining in the middle of the tropical and lush tree-lined pedestrian area. Home to the New World Symphony Orchestra, a state-of-the-art movie theater, and the Colony Theater, Lincoln Road is an arts and entertainment American cultural epicenter. Lincoln Road continues to be one of the most popular destinations for our visitors to Miami and the beaches. The Welcome Channel caught up with some local business owners and residents to bring you the inside story. Well, Lincoln Road has been a part of the fabric of Miami Beach for, for many, many, many years. But I, I, I will say that when we look at great destinations, we look at what the heart and soul of South Beach is. And I will tell you that Lincoln Road fits that bill. It's the epicenter of activities. It's a combination of restaurants and galleries and cafes and, and great retail that is a complete experience for the Miami Beach visitor. When you're visiting Miami and the beaches, Lincoln Road is clearly one destination you definitely don't want to miss. Hope to see you there. Carl Fisher, the builder and developer of Miami Beach, envisioned Lincoln Road as a future Rue de la Paix. In the 1930s, Miami Beach publicists began marketing Lincoln Road as the Fifth Avenue of the South. Originally, Lincoln Road was covered by a forest of mangroves, as was much of Miami Beach. On June 10, 1959, the road was closed to traffic to become one of the nation's first and largest pedestrian malls and one of the most unique outdoor destinations for Miamians and visitors alike. I love coming here and spending a lazy afternoon. You can waste an entire day just watching the scene, feeling the energy, and just really enjoying uh, relaxing at a leisurely pace and, and checking out everyone. It's, it's, there's no other place that you can do that. What's really great about Lincoln Road is that it happens 24 hours a day. You can come here for breakfast, brunch, lunch, or dinner. There's a variety of options. You can have American, Italian, pizza, Asian. You can grab beer. You can hang out. It's awesome people watching, and it's just sort of an all-purpose spot. Regardless of what you're looking for, there's something here. If you thought the restaurants were great, the fashions are even better. Lincoln Road is home to some of the most extraordinary shopping around the globe. Coming up, get ready to see fashion like you've never seen it before. Well, there are many factors that contribute to Lincoln Road being such a fantastic shopping destination. One of them, I think, is the layout of the place, the way it's all landscaped beautifully, the tropical air, the colorful residents. And all of that contributes to the type of shops that have sprung up here. They're all super fashion forward, very trendy. They feature lots of colorful selections. So at this point, you have world-class shopping, offerings on every level of every kind for every style. And you do it under the sun in this beautiful setting. So it's just kind of all around the perfect shopping destination. Visitors should come to Lincoln Road because Lincoln Road is where visitors and locals both come when they want to have a good time. The people watching is incomparable. This is the Champs-Élysées of Miami Beach. Lincoln Road is going to be the highlight of your visit. The beach is great. The nightclubs are great. But Lincoln Road is the soul of Miami Beach. Come see for yourself. Macy's is America's favorite department store. With over 800 locations nationwide, Macy's is recognized worldwide for its fashions, selection, and iconic events. Macy's offers the latest fashions and accessories from the most sought-after American designers and brands, making it a dynamic shopping experience for millions of visitors each year. With the Macy's Visitor Savings Program, domestic and international travelers receive an exclusive 10% discount on thousands of items throughout the store for multiple days of shopping. With qualifying ID, visitors can pick up a savings pass in any one of our stores or visitor centers nationwide. Macy's Visitor Program offers exclusive discounts on designer brands. 
Visitors can also take advantage of personal services at our centers, including informational maps and concierge services, such as restaurant suggestions and transportation advice. They can even purchase exclusive shopping packages tailored to the city they're visiting. For store locations and more information, visit www.visitmacysusa.com. You know paradise comes in many forms. And in Miami Beach, it's easy to see why. I just love shopping on Miami Beach. It's so great to be close to the ocean. The great thing about shopping on Miami Beach is there's plenty of public parking throughout the area. In fact, one of the best places you must experience by foot is Lincoln Road. This high energy pedestrian only hot spot with late night store hours has something for everyone. Bordering Lincoln Road is Washington Avenue. Known for legendary designer stores, club wear, designer jeans, and vintage clothing. Nearby is Collins Avenue, featuring more of the world's best known brand name designers. After all, you are in the middle of one of the most popular model and fashion shoot destinations in the universe. So let the fun begin. On your mark, get ready, and shop on Miami Beach. See your concierge for more information or visit shoponmiamibeach.com. Beginning with complicated precision instruments to navigate the seas. Swiss masterpieces with over 4,300 awards, including 18 gold medals. A leader in innovation. A pioneer in the use of advanced materials. A constant explorer. If you truly appreciate the heart and soul of the art of mechanical watches. The ultimate timepiece. The legendary name. Ulysse Nardin. Purchase a gift to be treasured forever. Hi, I'm Stephen Gamson, artist, and here we are at my studio, uh, home of Stephen Gamson Studios. I think art came to me. I don't believe that you, you can plan. It's a way of life. My inspiration is the place where I live, the, the city uh, of Miami. It's uh, absolutely beautiful, Miami Beach, with all of the different cultures, the sunshine, the beach, beautiful weather. There's something in the air, so that's, I would say, my greatest influence. Also, I've been influenced by uh, travel around the world, and um, that's really part of the basis of my work. I would really like to remind the viewers of my work that, uh, that you're so important to me uh, because I'm, I'm sending a message out to you and I'm hoping that you will find some sort of relationship with my art that brings you to a wonderful place in your life, a, a great time, uh, something filled with positive energy and, uh, and think of me as an artist that is recording history in an uplifting way. When you come to the International Jewelers Exchange, you come into a place with over 50 independent jewelers. And where else can you get an incredible array of diamonds, watches, jewelry, custom orders, repairs, coins, gold, silver, anything you need, we have it at the International Jewelers Exchange. Well, this is, April, a great destination for all the tourists, people coming on cruise ships, people staying over on their way to Latin America or wherever they're traveling. They come into a place with over 50 independent jewelers and it gives them the opportunity to price shop, compare, and they get opportunities to acquire Rolexes, Cartiers, diamonds at the best possible prices on the planet. 
I think this is a must visit destination for our visitors to Miami because everyone's looking today for good value. And when you come to the International Jewelers Exchange, you get the best value because of the competition. We've been here over 25 years. And in those 25 years, we've put together the best collection of jewelers, watchmakers, coin dealers, and you could buy anything you want for gifts or for yourself. So to all our visitors, all our tourists, we welcome you to the wonderful International Jewelers Exchange with over 52 independent jewelers. I hope to see you soon. In recent years, Miami has erupted onto the car racing scene, and Autocraze is the one-stop shop for all your motorcycle and auto racing needs. Autocraze carries parts and accessories from brand names like Arai Helmets, Momo, Alpine Stars, and Sparco. With personalized service and an experienced staff, Autocraze will be able to help you find any part you need. They can also help you look for parts of a pro racing machine. Autocraze carries car and motorcycle apparel for every budget, so make sure you check out their authentic racing gear. Autocraze is open from 9.30 a.m. to 6 p.m. Monday through Friday and from 10 till 2 on Saturday. The store's closed on Sundays. All major credit cards are accepted. The Tuyo Restaurant, we're part of the uh, Miami-Dade College of the Miami Culinary Institute, and we sit on the eighth floor, which is the rooftop overlooking all of downtown. The gastronomy of Tuyo is New World Cuisine, which is a term that I came up with many years ago, cooking in Key West. The idea of New World Cuisine is it's a celebration of the diverse cultures that comprise the populations of South Florida. And so you will see many elements of Latin, Caribbean, African, even Asian foods that really dot our menus and help us tell the story in very full flavored ways. When the guest sits down at the table at Tuyo, they have the opportunity to look at two different menus. We have the a la carte menu, and that changes uh, seasonally, along with uh, dishes that are Norman Van Aken's signature dishes. And then also, in addition to the a la carte, we have the tasting menu, but here we call it the Voyager menu. And so what that means is that we're going to take our guests on a voyage, starting right here at home in Miami, but then we're going to voyage out to many different ports of call in the world, and every month we'll go to a different one and uh, work with local produce and local fish and things like that, but conspire to make the menu in a way that really takes people on a journey. Everybody's discovering Tuyo. For over 20 years, Tony Chan's Water Club in the Doubletree Grand Hotel has been delighting Miami's clientele, serving contemporary Hong Kong-style Cantonese cuisine. Come and enjoy a romantic waterfront view while tasting our delicious and healthy dishes. Come to our happy hour, Monday through Friday from 6 to 8 p.m. We also offer fresh and high-quality sushi dishes. Enjoy Miami's premier Chinese restaurant, Tony Chan's Water Club, inside the Doubletree Grand Hotel. Welcome to the most exciting and sensual restaurant nightclub in South Beach, Mango's Tropical Cafe. Mango's is rocking in the afternoon and mesmerizing at night. It's the hottest show in town. Are you looking for an entertainment experience that will dazzle you? Come feel the beat of the King of Pop in Mango's fantastic Michael Jackson dance tribute. Our magnificent new Italian glass mosaic main bar is the heart and soul of Mango's Tropical Cafe. Mango's, Mango's. Enjoy your favorite champagne and premium bottle service in our new exclusive VIP seating area. Experience the color and excitement of the samba, the conga, and the world famous Mango's Dancers. Want a private party, Mango style? Mango's offers three magnificent private rooms for your special event. Are you getting married? At Mango's, we have the sexiest men in South Beach waiting to shake it up at your bachelorette party. Honor the bride-to-be in style with a big fun night out at Mango. Ooh, yeah. 
South Beach heat behind and treat yourself to one of our cool lemonade mojitos. Satisfy your appetite for a delicious lunch, dinner, or late night craving. Got a sweet tooth? Our homemade desserts are simply divine. So come, fall in love as so many millions from all around the world have and join us as we celebrate our 20th anniversary year. And remember, for South Beach sexy hot, you gotta do Mango Tropical Cafe, the heart of Ocean Drive. Fogo de Chao welcomes you to Miami Beach. We invite you to join us for an authentic Brazilian dining experience you will never forget where perfectly seasoned meats and impeccable service are the center of attention. Join us for an evening of true Brazilian hospitality in an exquisite, elegant atmosphere. In southern Brazil, the home of Fogo de Chão, they are famous for their churrasco barbecues, where gaucho Brazilian cowboys slowly grilled meats over an open flame. While the meats take center stage at Fogo de Chão, the restaurant also boasts a gourmet salad bar, featuring a variety of more than 30 items, including cheeses, vegetables, and cured meats, with limitless sides that are served tableside, along with an award-winning wine list and authentic Brazilian drinks. My name is Paulo Simonetti, and I am the general manager of uh, Fogo de Chão, Miami Beach. Uh, in Fogo, we prepare the meats uh, the same way that we've been doing from centuries ago, learning from our grandfather to father, father to son, and we keep alive until these days. So the way we cook the meats, the way we cut and skewer them, that's for me is the best way of uh, preparation. I would like to invite all the guests to come to Fogo and uh, having a unique experience because we are going to provide to them in a traditional authentic sound of Brasilia steakhouse way of serving meats and we as well would like to have the opportunity to show them that we are able to exceed their every expectation. You know when you have that agonizing decision at lunch you're hungry but you have so many options and so much inner turmoil well Lunch doesn't have to be your daily Sophie's choice. Let's break it down. Eat a burger, some pizza, or a fatty foot long, then this is very likely in your future. But if you make a healthy choice, you can have all the flavor and look to this as your future. Okay, we're taking it to extremes, but the message is clear. You are what you eat. And when you need to eat healthy for lunch today, look to Rice House of Kebab. For over 30 years, Garcia's Seafood Grill and Fish Market has brought Florida the freshest seafood around. People know that they can get a variety of fish to take home or have it expertly prepared in one of our delicious flavored butters. We recently expanded to the second floor where you will find plasma TVs catching the best games, regular happy hours, and a full service liquor bar. We also offer fresh stone crabs from our own boats October 15th to May 15th. Garcia's Seafood Grill and Fish Market, 390 Northwest River Drive. Come visit us Monday through Sunday, 11 a.m. to 10 p.m. and enjoy live jazz performances on Sundays from 4 to 7. Every day, visitors from around the world enjoy the sun, surf, shopping, nightlife, and entertainment, and all the cultural attractions that this world-renowned city has to offer. Discover a brand new concept in restorative hydration and overall wellness. Had a hot day? Had an even hotter night? Replenish, rehydrate, revive. Rehydrate with a variety of saline infusions, formulated with vitamins, pain relievers, or energy boosters. Let us restore your system, no matter how much you play, work, travel, or party. Replenish your body at Revive Net Spa, a brand new concept in wellness, now open on South Beach. Sandwich Heaven. Food savvies everywhere know that if you're looking for true sandwich heaven, there's only one place in the world to go. 
La Sandwicherie in South Beach captures the best of French savoir faire in the simplest of settings to transport your taste buds to another world without costing you the earth. Daily fresh ingredients, crisp baguettes or croissants, and the added magic of the famous vinaigrette make for a true taste sensation, served up with smoothies and shakes and an attitude only the French can truly master. So today we are in La Sandwicherie in Brickell, the new location. We've been open here for 10 months now. We've been in the beach for 25 years and we bring the beach, you know, touch, you know, to Brickell. Zagat raves of the best sandwiches on the planet, but if you're lucky enough to have eaten at La Sandwicherie, you'll know it's much more. It's the one and only La Sandwicherie, sandwich heaven. Hey, that's not cool. Keep our beaches clean. It's our responsibility. Pass it on. Do you want to do something exciting today? How about flying high in the sky overlooking beautiful Hollywood Beach? Or racing through the Atlantic Ocean on a jet ski? Parasailing with Top Gun Parasailing and Hollywood Jet Skiing is just your ticket for fun. Both are located on the beach behind the Marriott Hollywood at 2501 North Ocean Drive, Hollywood Beach, Florida. Parasailing is an activity that can be experienced by people of all ages from 5 to 95. It's fun, it's safe, it's exciting. Whether you want to cool off with a dip in the water at the end of your ride or simply enjoy the breeze, Top Gun Parasailing and Hollywood Jet Skiing offer all the right options for you. If you want to get wet parasailing, the boat can be slowed down for a dip into the water and back before coming in for a landing. Or choose to skip this and stay dry throughout the entire parasail flight, flying high in the sky. With Hollywood Jet Ski, the choice is all yours. I consider Hollywood Beach to be the best beach in South Florida. And what better place to go jet skiing is right here on Hollywood Beach. The rush of going fast on the water, there's nothing like it. You know, I've never seen anybody get off a jet ski without a smile. Parasailing and jet skiing in Hollywood Beach. What a great way to spend your day. Come see Top Gun Parasail and Jet Ski Hollywood and see why they are the very best. Hi, I'm April Donaldson. Everyday visitors from all over the world come right here to Miami and its beautiful beaches. And what so many people don't know is this area is home to so many health and fitness activities. So what we're gonna do today on Out of Miami is give you an inside look into some of Miami and the beach's very best. So let's go out to Miami, coming up. So here I am at Iron Flower Fitness, ready to check out some of the best classes in all of Miami and the beaches. Brazilian butt, they've got booty bounce that we're gonna go to. Also Pilates uh, jump board, which is amazing. It's a great workout. So let's get this day started. We are such a, a wide variety of uh, gym that we offer to women and we cater to women only. We have over 100 classes on our schedule. We have over 33 different styles of fitness that we offer here. Anywhere from abs and butt, Zumba, Pilates reformer. We cater to all women of all shapes, all sizes, all walks of life. And everyone's and so one nice table. here. One of the most fun things about Iron Flower Fitness is they've got you covered with parties, bachelorette parties, celebrations, whatever you want to do, they've got it going on here. Something I love so much about Miami and the beaches is Pasha's. Whether I'm at the gym finishing a workout or out here on the beach, they're always right there with my smoothie. Always healthy, always delicious. Alright, so I'm wrapping up my day at Iron Flower Fitness. And we're going to be checking out some more healthy options across Miami and the beaches the beach pretty soon. But if you're here in Miami, you've got to check out the fitness classes here. They really are the best. So I am sitting here with my very good friend, Miss Alessandra Grieco. She is the marketing and catering manager for Pasha's Healthy Mediterranean Cuisine. Through Pasha's, we, uh, we always make sure that we're involved with the community. It's something very special to us. We like to help different local organizations. We like to help a lot of the nonprofits. 
uh, as well as having partnerships with uh, wellness centers, people, people, absolutely. And we, we try to assist and help people in living a healthy lifestyle any way possible. That includes their dining habits as well as working out and just being overall well-rounded and uh, healthy. Tell me a little bit about the delivery. What makes Pasha's really interesting is that we're extremely accommodating to what people's needs are and knowing that people are on the beach doing a bunch of different activities all the time, we try to make things as easy for them as possible while they eat healthy. Wherever you want your good, healthy, nutritious food, we've got you covered. I mean, the office, whatever you need, we're there for you. Love it. I get delivery all the time. At <laughs> I know you it's do. It's good stuff. So be powered by Pasha's. When you're headed out to the beach, you've got to be stylish. Make sure you stop in and check out Carizas Swimwear. Right now, I'm here with Francisco Escudero of Sky Bandits Kite Surfing. Francisco, hello. Hello, how you doing? Good. What have you got going on out here? Well, what we do, we specialize in kiteboarding instruction to teach people to master the sport of kiteboarding. And then we do paddleboarding to do fitness activities and play with the wind. Francisco, tell me about the Sky Fitness program you've got going on out here. Well, Sky Fitness is uh, all about playing with the power kites, with playing with the element of wind to work out and keep yourself uh, active. What would you say to people that are a little hesitant about making this a part of their workout regimen? Well, I mean, why wouldn't you want to come outdoors and play with the element of wind, have fun, you know, learn about uh, the power kites, so then in the future you might try the sport of kiteboarding. Francisco, how did you get started in all of this? Well, I basically got started for the love of like water sports. I'm a competitive swimmer since I was young. Then I transitioned into skateboarding, surfing, and other board sports. And once I discovered the element of wind, it captured me. I hope you've enjoyed taking a look at Miami and its beaches health and fitness activities on Active Miami. Looking forward to seeing you here in world famous Miami and the beaches. Explore Miami with Bike and Roll on a Segway or bike. It's the fun way to discover Miami. Join Bike and Roll on one of their entertaining Segway tours or rent a Segway and glide around with a friend. Segways are a fantastic way to tour. It's the way to roll. The Art Deco Segway Tour departs daily from two convenient South Beach locations. To reserve a spot, visit bikemiami.com or call 305-604-0001. In addition to Segways, Bike and Roll also offers a large selection of guided bike tours and rides. Miami is a fantastic place for biking. Ride along the beach path and across the Venetian Islands to Bayside. Or continue to Little Havana, Vizcaya, and Coconut Grove. For the more adventurous, join Bike and Roll for a guided tour to Key Biscayne or for the Bike and Kayak Tour. Bike and Roll carries a wide variety of rental bikes for all ages and sizes. The bikes are perfect for longer rides and more affordable than the city vending bikes for extended rentals beyond one hour. For a complete list of bike and Segway rides and tours, visit BikeMiami.com or ask your concierge for a free Bike and Roll map and brochure. Bike and Roll has three locations by 10th Street and Collins Avenue, at Lincoln Road and James Avenue, and at Bayside Marketplace. To book your fun, call Bike and Roll at 305-604-0001 or visit them online at bikemiami.com. Speedboat Tours of Miami lets you be the captain of your very own 15-foot speedboat. The only catch, you follow a guide who keeps you out of trouble and shows you all the sights. The whole thrill of it is that you get to drive personally and there's nothing else like it in the market that exists at the price point where it's at, where you get to drive the boat, get the tour, and really see some of the best parts of Miami. Well, we come to Gator Park 
First of all, you do an air boat ride. When you come back from your boat ride, you have a 35 minute wildlife show. Everybody gets a chance to hold an alligator if you like to. Come out to Gator Park, be right in the middle of everything. And this is the greatest experience you can get in the Everglades at all. Miami's favorite attraction is the spectacular Miami Seaquarium off the Rickenbacker Causeway on the way to Key Biscayne. This watery adventure land delights and entertains young and old alike. Dolphins and sea lions are always ready to put on a spectacular show for you. And Lolita, the killer whale show, defies belief. The beautiful trained whale makes quite a splash with her fans. New to the park is the brand new Dolphin Harbor, which opened July 19, 2007. Dolphin Harbor is a brand new Swim with the Dolphins facility, which includes two separate programs. One, our Dolphin Encounter, and two, our Dolphin Odyssey program. Miami Seaquarium is a great fun and learning center with marine animals, exciting shows, and exhibits. A day at Miami Seaquarium puts a smile on everyone's face. Do you want to meet me? I want to meet you. I was thinking we could get together do this and do that and maybe we could be friends come make friends at miami seaquarium call now and make plans to get in the water with our friendly dolphins or try a new sea trek reef encounter only at miami seaquarium all across the sunshine state folks are looking for something different close to home a place that's fun and friendly with a cool beach attached, that's where we come in. From the sand to the city, a town on the edge of something big, where you can just be yourself. Come on down and dream. Come on down and dream. Hollywood, Florida's hometown beach town. Come for the day or come and stay. For more information on events and attractions in Florida's Hollywood, visit GoHollywoodFLA.org. On George Merrick's plantation, an extraordinary team of designers, artists, architects, and landscapers was assembled. He sent them to Spain, Italy, and the Mediterranean to gather material for the city he envisioned. Included in the plan was a business district full of banks and commerce similar to Wall Street in New York. But Coral Gables isn't just a place for business, it's also a place for leisure. If you're a connoisseur of fine dining, you won't find a better variety of restaurants, usually all within walking distance or a quick drive from wherever you're staying. After a delicious meal, be sure to wander through our beautiful city streets, such as Ponce de Leon Boulevard or Miracle Mile. You'll see attractive shops with the European charm that Coral Gables is known for. Hi, my name is Rachel Dominguez. I'm the owner of the Dome Restaurant Bar and Lounge, and I want to welcome you. Fresh ingredients, Florida Farms, unique combinations, pistachio garlic breadcrumbs, guava flavored cream cheese, spicy lime garlic sauce. A new taste sensation has arrived in Coral Gables. Be among the first to experience the uncommon flavor of this modern, environmentally conscious restaurant. We offer live music, and we offer a variety of Cuban Caribbean food, which is definitely part of the culture here in South Florida. The entire restaurant is green, made from self-sustainable, post-consumer recycled materials, with all ingredients coming in fresh from local organic Florida farms. In addition to the iPad paperless menus in five languages, waiters carry wireless ordering systems to communicate with the kitchen. With automatic wine pairings, digital menus, and a twist of Latin flavor, the Dome restaurant is the first of its kind. Visitors coming here to the Dome will find a fusion of Latin, Cuban, and Caribbean food also served with caviar. I think that's one thing that definitely differentiates us from a lot of restaurants, because how many restaurants do you go to that are pairing dishes with caviar? We're definitely doing that here at the Dome. While visiting Coral Gables and Miracle Mile, be sure to visit iDesign's Optical Boutique. iDesign's an upscale boutique featuring an excellent selection of fashionable eyewear and stylish sunglasses. 
featuring luxurious brands such as Oliver Peoples, Tom Ford, and Chrome Hearts. So we're very lucky that we live in South Florida. It is summer here year round and people here are very into fashion and luckily we have a lot to offer our clients. Everyone here knows the brands, they know what everyone's wearing, and it's all about fashion. So we're located on Miracle Mile, and we're open 10 to 7, Monday through Saturday. A lot of times on prescriptions, we will offer next day service, and we ship anywhere within the States and internationally as well. Get ready for some fun in the South Florida sun and let eye designs get you into that gorgeous pair of sunglasses from distinct sunglass designers, including Chanel and Gucci. Eye Designs Optical is located at 210 Miracle Mile in historic Coral Gables. Call ahead for appointments at 305-774-6900. Miami has been described as an international destination where cultures blend, creating unique communities and neighborhoods hard to find in other parts of the globe. The Miami Design District brings together world-class design items, works of art, and fashions from around the globe. From home decor to shopping, this area has you covered, with the world's best calling the Miami Design District home. What visitors can find here, more than furniture and just accessories, they can find Armani lifestyle, which is something different. It's a way of leaving the home, it's a way of conceiving, the way of staying in our home. So uh, nothing more than what is necessary, as Mr. Armani says. We'd like to welcome all of you to come down and visit our store at the Miami Design District, Jalan Jalan, to view our unique ethnic chic mix. The Miami Design District is considered an international lifestyle brand name by visitors as well as locals who find in its showrooms, stores, galleries and restaurants the very best. My name is Charles Bell. I'm the Director of Operations for the Genuine Hospitality Group which includes Michael's Genuine Food and Drink Miami. We source so much of our food here locally. We cook things in the wood burning oven. In addition to that, we do whole fish that we caught locally that day. And we also have our, our pastry chef, Hetty Goldsmith, who does exceptional daily specials every day. When you're in Miami, you must visit Michael's Genuine Food and Drink. We look forward to seeing you in the design district. I'm Simeon Humphreys. I'm the general manager of Harry's Pizzeria. You know, I've traveled all across the country, but I think this is the only pizzeria in America that's run by a James Beard award-winning chef. Uh, the quality of the food, the freshest ingredients, our commitments to local uh, sourcing, the com helping the community out, all of this makes this a, a must-see for visiting guests. Hi, my name is William Bramer. I'm the director of Art Fusion Galleries here in the Miami Design District. Well, Art Fusion Galleries has been here for 11 years and we uh, represent emerging to mid-career artists. Very few galleries that represent emerging to mid-career artists, so we're, it's, it's the masters of the future. So it's really important when people come to Miami to come to Art Fusion Galleries. First of all, it's a 4,000 square foot gallery with a lot of different contemporary artwork with a lot of different styles and um, it's a great place to uh, just visit. We're friendly, um, we're uh, centrally located, we're close to Miami Beach, and we're very close to Brickell Avenue. We're also close to the Wynwood area, which is the new Art District Center. Um, so Art Fusion Gallery is a destination place. When you come to Miami, you make sure you come to the beach, use some sunscreen, have a lot of fun, enjoy the nightlife, and don't forget to visit Art Fusion Galleries in the Miami Design District. Art Fusion Galleries is now one of the longest standing art galleries located in the Miami Design District, a testament to the vision of the gallery's roots. Situated in the heart of Miami's Design District, the 4,000 square foot Chelsea style gallery showcases an international collection of original art from a spectacular array of talented artists. For more information about the Miami Design District, go to www.designdistrict.net. Hi, my name is Fernando Miro. I am a circus performer in the show Orchid. Uh, my name is Patrick Ortiz, and I play the role of the beekeeper. Uh, Lexi Romano, and I play Orchid. My name is Kitty Bang Bang, um, and I'm a fire and burlesque performer in Orchid the Show.
my role in All Good The Show is the Master Gardener's cat. I'm sort of like his familiar and I go out and I do his dirty work and I spy on people and I keep an eye on what's happening in the garden. In Orchid Kid The Show, I am a circus performer slash acrobat slash dancer. I have several acts in the show. We have performers from all over the world. We have acrobats that are elite, like really high level of skilled. The beekeeper is this sinister, sexually charged um, villain, basically, of the show, trying to corrupt this perfect garden that the master gardener created. Orchid is kind of like the perfect creation made by the master gardener, and so she is his most perfect flower. She's kind of a, a youthful young girl when she's first born and she has sort of a sexual awakening throughout the first act. But unfortunately, since she's an orchid, uh, once they are pollinated, they kind of put out this vapor. So it kind of makes all the other characters go crazy, like sex crazy a little bit. And that kind of fuels the rest of the storyline. If you're in Miami, you need to come see this show. It's a once in a lifetime experience. And it's all beautifully done in this amazing venue. It's just nothing ever like I've ever seen before. If you're in Miami, you have to come see Orchid because it's a great show, it's very entertaining, and you'll love it. In the hip, up-and-coming Wynwood Arts District, visitors are welcome to Jimmy's Kitchen, an American Latin fusion contemporary restaurant. Renowned for its healthy and delicious fare, Jimmy's Kitchen has been recognized by Zagat with an impressive 25 rating. Chef Jimmy Carey has carefully created a diverse menu of healthy choices, ranging from appealing paninis like the Cuban sandwich, the chicken prosciutto, and the club panini, to tasty salads like the flavorful jerk chicken, the hearty cob, and the Asian-inspired ahi tuna salads. Known for its savory entrees, especially the traditional Puerto Rican mofongo, visitors can find something for every palate, including steak frites, chicken portobella, or the ahi tuna special. The varied menu is perfectly complemented with a distinctive and varied wine selection and 40-plus bottle craft beers. We created the uh, Jimmy's Kitchen concept for it to be a fine dining experience for our guests in a very casual setting. We're very proud of our flagship location in Wynwood and our smaller restaurant in South Beach. With two central locations, the flagship Wynwood restaurant at 2700 North Miami Avenue and the deli-style South Beach Bistro at 1542 Alton Road, Jimmy's Kitchen is easily accessible for dine-in, delivery, and takeout by patrons in Miami Beach, downtown, and Brickell areas. Visit our website, www.jimmyzkitchen.com. Be sure not to leave South Florida without having a taste of Jimmy's Kitchen. in the design district, a fabulous new store, sort of an outpost of the nest that famously was on Lincoln Road for so many years. We're also celebrating the new issue of Indulge Magazine. It's a new magazine from the Miami Herald, uh, and it focuses on exquisite, fine living in South Florida. The finest places, the finest people, and the finest things. This party is to celebrate the opening of our new Nest showroom in the design district. We have our furniture and lighting collection, which was different from the collection we had on Lincoln Road, which was mainly accessories. We wanted to come out and see what this new Indulge magazine was all about, so we're really excited to be here, be a part of this, and actually the store is really excellent. The furniture is magnificent. I mean, it's top of the line, it's, it's elegant, it's contemporary, it's, it's just beautiful. 
Oh, Indulge Magazine is fabulous. I love Betty. She's a great writer. You have a great readership, and, uh, and it's a wonderful magazine. I'm very excited. Indulge Magazine is actually distributed within the Miami Herald in the Sunday edition, so you have to subscribe. For those who don't receive it, run out and subscribe. It comes out once every two months, and we've got some great issues planned for 2013. More home and decor, more food and wine, more beautiful travel, and more uh, wonderful living in South Florida. A charming walking village with tree-lined streets that lead down to one of the world's most beautiful sailing bays. Every great city has a secret heart, a tucked away treasure. In Miami, the enchanted heart at the center of our tropical soul is called Coconut Grove. Coconut Grove. They write songs about this place. Trees, shopping, flowers, whimsy strolling past street musicians along brick walkways, the Welcome Channel presents some can't-miss locales to check out while visiting this famous neighborhood. Vizcaya Museum and Gardens is an extraordinary European-inspired estate that includes a house filled with art and furnishings and 10 acres of magnificent gardens on Biscayne Bay. It was built by agricultural industrialist James Deering, who wintered on the property from 1916 through 1925. With its unique architecture, gardens, interiors, and decorative arts, Vizcaya helps visitors understand the so-called Gilded Age in America and Miami's place in this history, the role of internationalism in the United States and local culture, and the richness of art, interior design, architecture, and landscape design. For decades, Vizcaya has been a diplomatic seat of Miami-Dade County, having hosted some of the world's most renowned dignitaries, such as Queen Elizabeth II, Pope John Paul II, President Ronald Reagan, and King Juan Carlos I and Queen Sophia of Spain, and major international events, such as the Summit of the Americas, the signing of the Free Trade Agreement, and activities associated with Art Basel. In addition, thousands of Miami-Dade residents have chosen to commemorate some of the most important occasions of their lives at Vizcaya. Distinguished as a National Historic Landmark and accredited by the American Association of Museums, Vizcaya is open daily, except Tuesday, from 9.30 a.m. to 4.30 p.m. Vizcaya Museum and Gardens is located at 3251 South Miami Avenue, between Brickell Avenue and Coconut Grove in Miami, Florida. For more information, visit www.vizcayamuseum.org or call 305-250-9133. The Welcome Channel presents Miami and the Beaches condominium previews and developer profiles. Hi, I'm Carolina Diago, your host for this very special look at Miami and the Beaches hottest real estate areas, including opinions from some of Miami's most known developers and real estate professionals. Miami and the beaches is hot, but not just in the summer. The heat is year round, and that is why buyers are coming from everywhere. Just over 60% of real estate purchases last year were from international buyers. Nine of every 10 purchases of recent built condos in the downtown Miami area were also from international buyers. It's no secret that Miami is a hotbed of international tourism. I mean, why not? Look around me. This place is so beautiful. Now, more than ever, however, what used to be a place for vacation to some is now the playground of the whole world, and everyone wants a piece of it. Let me introduce you to Andres Acion from Fortune International, who has been specializing in international buyers. When thinking about buying property in Miami, there's no better guide than Fortune International's Andres Acion. Thank you very much. Thank you for being here today. My pleasure. Tell me a little bit about the history of Fortune International. So Fortune basically started three decades ago by Edgardo de Fortuna. He is the founder, CEO, and president of Fortune International. And the purpose of setting up this company was to create a company that set a new benchmark for selling real estate throughout South Florida, and they achieved it. What is it that you think ends up attracting 
Miami's visitors to become buyers. You have the beaches, you have businesses, you have banks, you have beautiful homes, and you have the culture. And now, even better, you also get to add all the arts into the mix. How do you compare the real estate market, Miami's real estate market, to London, Paris, and New York, let's say? The reason why Miami is so special is because it's such a quick hop from so many places. So it's a quick hop from Mexico, it's a quick hop from New York. It makes it very easy for people to call this home. So will you show me now Fortune's amazing projects? Yes, come this way, I'll show you some of our, some of the projects in our portfolio. Bueno, Andres, tell me about Fortune's most recent projects that you're most excited about. You know, Carolina, that's a hard answer because I'm excited about a lot of our projects. And the reason why is that there's something special in each one of our projects. I'll give you an example. Um, Paramount Bay was uh, envisioned by Lenny Kravitz himself, uh, which established a company called Kravitz Design. And the finishes of this project are spectacular. It set a new benchmark for the area where Paramount Bay is at. Milicento is another perfect example, designed by Pinin Farina, which is known for designing Ferraris and all the high-end cars. First time they're doing a project in North America, and they did it together with a related group uh, in designing this spectacular project. Midtown 4, this is one of the hottest new areas of South Florida. Um, our Basel, as you know, is coming in December, and they have satellite fairs surrounding Midtown. This building is in the middle of all the satellite fairs. Art Asia, Scope, it's right in the center. Amazing lifestyle, and this is a perfect example of something which is inexpensive, in the heart of it all, in a booming area in Miami. One Ocean, this is in the middle, right in the center of South Beach. Uh, Enrique Norton, world-renowned architect, is a designer on this project. Only 50 exclusive residences. Actually, George Perez says he's even keeping one of the penthouses for himself, which is um, speaks very highly of, of the project. So there's a little bit for everybody. It, you know, and this is a great spot to start. If you're looking to buy something, if you come to our corporate offices here, you know, this is a great point where you can start understanding the, the market in general and all the different segments of South Florida and get a good grasp of where you could uh, where you could purchase your next home. Andres, I can't thank you enough for this information. It's really wonderful and valuable. And now I have to choose what I'm gonna buy. So I'm gonna stay here with Andres and we'll see you guys later. Can't wait. Oh my, how things have changed. You thought luxurious condo projects magnificently designed were only for Miami? Well, check this out, the beautiful Beach Walk, another masterful project by Pinin Farina, right here in the heart of Hallandale Beach.
time to broaden your horizons, people. Look at this paradise. Regalia, oceanfront magnificence in Sunny Isle, designed by the one and only Bernardo Fort Brescia from Arquitectonica, a new project under construction that you have to check out. Introducing Regalia, on the ocean, in one of Miami's most exclusive enclaves, Sunny Isles Beach. Currently under construction and scheduled for completion the fourth quarter of 2013. Regalia is a contemporary oceanfront residential masterpiece, featuring characteristics that have never been constructed before in any Miami, Florida skyscraper. With just one residence on each floor and only 39 exclusive residences, Regalia caters to the very successful and sophisticated. The unique design, conceived by Bernardo Fortbreschi, project architect and principal of world-renowned design firm Architectonica, is a 46-story, 500-foot high-rise building that has the appearance of moving in the sky as the 360-degree wrap-around undulating balconies change positions slightly with every floor. It had to make a bigger statement than just a building. It had to be a sculpture, it's like a totem, it's sort of the announcement that here you're arriving to a whole new place. Almost like the wind had to sort of shape the building into this very organic shape or, or that the forms of the ocean had sort of become a building in the, the location of the, of the site. If you really go to that beach and you stand there and you feel the waves coming towards you and you feel the wind, it is, when you turn around, the building is a physical realization of the, of the feelings that you get when you're in that, on that beach. Here, the best of beachfront living merges with all things exciting about city life. Regalia is located in prestigious Sunny Isles Beach on a 180-foot wide oceanfront parcel overlooking the most pristine and widest beach in South Florida. Just minutes from Miami Beach, downtown Miami, and some of the finest shopping in the world. Regalia is situated in an international hub with the global gateways of Fort Lauderdale and Miami International Airports easily accessible. With over 7,600 square feet, 5,515 interior square feet, and a 2,100 square foot wraparound terrace. Residences feature a separate service utility room with full bathroom and storage, private elevator galleries, wet walls throughout the core area, enabling a buyer design flexibility to create customized spaces, and a smart panel, allowing personal customization, worldwide access, and connection to all building services. The 41-foot long kitchen offers a breakfast room and separate breakfast bar, chef island with oversized cooktop and ducted custom hood, two stainless steel sinks with a courtesy cooking pot filler faucet, concealed dishwasher and dish drawer, two side-by-side -side refrigerators, double oven, cappuccino maker, microwave, dishwasher and dish drawer, and wine cellar with over a 100 bottle capacity. There is also a summer kitchen barbecue opening onto the terrace. A two mile long unobstructed panoramic view from the opulent European master bath offers an oversized vessel soaking tub opening to the terrace, stone countertops, a his and her vanity, linen storage and wall hung water closets and bidet. His and hers teak floored glass showers include handhelds, rain heads, bench and doors that open directly to the terrace. Common area finishes include designer lighting throughout with the finest of stone, woods, glass and wall coverings, as well as site commissioned artwork and customized furnishings that have been designed exclusively for regalia. Surrounded by lush tropical landscaping, owners will enjoy a deck entry pool cold plunge pool, and oceanfront jacuzzi. Nestled among the dunes are private poolside cabanas equipped with both refrigerators and sinks. Private beach and poolside service are available to cater to your every need. Regalia condominiums starting at six million. Visit our sales center by appointment only. Call 305-405-3270. For more information, visit www. RegaliaMiami.com. 
What can be said about South Beach that hasn't been said already? The glitz, the glamour, the playground of the rich and famous. And that was 10 years ago. Today, South Beach is one of the most sought after real estate locations in the world. And we're going to show you why. Throughout the last two decades, the name Michael Capone has become synonymous with luxury construction and design, quality entertainment, and a passion toward humanitarian causes. His internationally acclaimed ventures and his development projects have earned him the reputation as one of Miami's most respected and well-known entrepreneurs. Licensed general contractors, Capone Construction Group was conceptualized when Michael Capone brought together a team of senior level construction industry executives with proven track records. Kenneth J. Gross, Robert Reedon, and John Galena are all renowned for building the kind of high-end and luxury residential and commercial projects that continue to make South Florida one of the most vibrant destinations in the United States. President and CEO Kenneth Gross and Executive Vice President of Construction Robert Reedon bring a combined total of almost 70 years of industry experience to the table and are personally involved in every project from initial review through delivery, including new construction and renovation of significant private residences and estates, and new construction of boutique hotels, and the renovation and new construction of high-end commercial projects. The Welcome Channel sat down with Michael Capone in his home adorned with ancient Peruvian artifacts to discuss Capone Construction Group. I came to Miami Beach really young, at a very young age. I was a busboy on Ocean Drive at the Palace Bar and Grill in like 1987. So I got to see firsthand every single building on Ocean Drive get revitalized one by one. I was involved in the opening of a lot of different nightclubs in the very early 90s. So all of that experience, I think, combined with you know, owning a construction company today has really led me to understand how a city grows and how it becomes better. And um, you, know, you look at what Miami Beach today, it's one of the most vibrant cities in America. Over the years, Michael's annual birthday bashes have transformed from simply glamorous parties into opportunities to raise funds and awareness about issues close to his heart. You know, I believe if you're going to be successful, you should give back to the world. And uh, I've spent a lot of my efforts, you know, traveling around the world, helping with humanitarian causes, specifically in Haiti. You know, Muhammad Ali had a quote, philanthropy and charity work is the rent you pay to live on Earth. And uh, I think that's the motto of our company. And uh, as we grow, you know, we try to do great things for the planet and make it a better place. If you want to own a piece of paradise, you have come to the right place. Stay tuned as you meet some of South Florida's most successful real estate movers and shakers as they guide you through the process of owning a piece of magnificence. Call Moises Schwartz for all your real estate needs. Whether you're looking to buy or sell a condo on the beach or a home, Moises will help you through every step of the process. Moises Schwartz at Fine Realty Group, 305-987-9179 or www.buyandsellmymiami.com. Who are these buyers and where are they coming from? Many are from Brazil, as the country's currency, the real, has risen almost 40% to the dollar in the past two years. Venezuelans, Colombians, and people from Russia and the rest of Western Europe have also made up the group of international buyers that are buying up Miami and its beaches in droves. Brazilians, Venezuelans, Colombians, Europeans are sweeping up Miami's condos at a record-setting pace. The international market is booming and condos are selling like nothing else. 90% of Miami's new condo sales are going to international buyers thanks to favorable economic conditions in their countries coupled with spectacular projects in different Miami areas. And for more on Miami and the beaches, stay with us on the Welcome Channel.